Four movie thoughts. So while I was a little disappointed that the killer was not in fact a monkey, and slightly confused by the fact that Hayden Panettiere apparently took the Y in her character name to represent the chromosome, and her hair really wasn't that flattering either. I like the hero's jab, by the way. You know, I've got superpowers. Yeah. The identity of the killers. Great. You know, <laughs> to have it actually be, you know, the horror film geek. You know, nice nod to Randy. And then the the star, supposed star, you know, Sydney's alter ego mirror image with a twist kind of thing. And she really did look quite innocent. And I like that they threw in the creepy boyfriend too, you know, just to really get things. He was just creepy right from the get go. I mean, I'm not sure even Stu Billy, not Stu Billy, was creepy right from the very get-go, not until, you know, a little later on in the first film, but yeah, and then the whole point of, you know, kids today, what do they want? They want to be famous. Why do they want to be famous? They just want to be famous. They don't want to have to do anything. The less they have to do, equaling the more fame, the better, you know, and yeah, just, and Three climaxes, sort of, you know, we have the party, then we have, you know, Kirby's house, and then the hospital with, you know, after all this death, she's like, oh, well, I've just, I'm sorry, I'm the only survivor. Oh, you're not the only survivor. What? And she goes and freaking tries to kill... Sydney, just to make sure, you know, and you have that little touch of, you know, we have matching wounds now. How did she know where my wound was, you know? And, you know, the final standoff with, what, four or five characters, you know, you got all three survivors of the trilogy, you've got the, you know, let's be honest, everybody, at least for a little while, we thought that the you know, Deputy was, you know, one of the killers, at least. She had that kind of thing of, oh, I guess she does. You just don't remember me. You had a lot of stuff back then, you know. And she clearly wants Gail out of the picture. And just the... the finishing off of her... of the killer, Jill with, you know, just one last word, because she can tell what Sydney's doing, you know, what, please, no, clear, 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 just, yeah, and nice to touch, you know, after, you know, killing and stabbing in the others, you know, and, and just, Jill's pure insanity, her harming herself, I'll admit, I almost chuckled, at least once during that, and I believe someone else actually in the theater actually did go ahead and chuckle out loud at that, but it was also pretty creepy. And you're just, you know, wondering, okay, how long is she gonna keep harming herself? You know, the, the knife and the glass table, yeah. And the three opening scenes, you know, first we have you know, the either teleporting killer or two killers revealed right from the get-go, and then, you know, someone stops that movie, and it's like, you know, no, this is, this is the real movie, you know, we think at that point, and then they have the self-awareness, the meta going on, you know, with, oh, what, we're just, it's a movie within a movie that's so meta. This isn't 1996 anymore. And the whole... F and then... Kristen Bell stabs Anna Paquin. And... Yeah. 
<laughs> didn't see that coming. And then that was another movie within a movie. And finally we're in the real opening sequence. That just... And I like the little jab at horror franchises that go on for far too long. The thing with, oh, the fifth one had time travel, by far the worst one. Yeah, I'm not sure I've watched a horror sequel, I haven't watched all of them, that had time travel, but yeah. Nice touch that, you know, oh, at first it was sort of a story, but then by the end, yeah, because that happens sometimes. They kind of forget that there was a story to begin with, and it's suddenly completely different just with the same name on it. Yeah, I think that's about what I have to say in this video, so hope you enjoyed it.